y'all it's me miss ashley and one on youtube or i'm ashcat acg on facebook and now you can follow me on twitter at one two three hcg me um i know it's been probably what about a month since i've made a vlog well a month since i've uploaded i tried to do a couple of tips and tricks and it just was not working so um when i get a little bit more time i'm gonna try and redo those so that they can be um up to date and address some of the things and um you know whatever i'm still around um as y'all know normally around this time of the year i get extremely busy because it's um it's the holiday season and besides all of my party planning we do christmas decor we decorate if y'all follow me on facebook i've been updating little things here and there i should like get something down i should have gotten something and showed it to you so you could see it like in person in the store um because the camera doesn't really do a lot of the things justice but anyway that doesn't matter i finished the house last night at like I got home at 11.30 something. So, yeah. Um, we decorate homes. We decorate offices. We still help people with their parties. Then I still have all my brides that are getting married next year. And we're getting all of their stuff, you know, laid out and situated and as far as their design schemes and plans and trying to keep them in budget and stuff. And then on top of that, um, y'all know that we, well, not we, it is we but me i'm also an hcg coach now and i'm working with a couple of the local doctor's offices here as their hcg consultant and i also have my um clients that i'm coaching on a regular basis and we speak all the time and some of them come you know we help with their plans and transition from p2 to p3 actually into p4 and um consulting with different trainers and physicians about what type of exercises you should be doing and whatever whatever you know so anyway i'm busy just like everybody else is busy so i know that's not really an excuse but i remember last year at christmas time i kind of fell off the um map too with the youtube fam so sorry y'all i miss y'all hey to all my new subscribers it's crazy looking at us like hey um thank you to all the new members of the recipe club um I think there are about 10 people that joined over the past couple of days and I want to apologize there was something going on with the servers and y'all's memberships didn't even um, show up I got a call um, from my customer service um, my head of customer service talking about all these new subscriptions and today is like the 30th but the dates on them were like the 26th the 27th the 28th so sorry don't be freaked out um, he told me he got everything sent out to everybody this morning as far as your passwords and all of that stuff and if you're having some problems y'all know y'all can email and if y'all are friends of me on facebook or if y'all follow me here on youtube send me an inbox i respond um i'm trying to think now that all that mess is out of the way let's get to the important stuff where everybody wants to know about look i still have my clavicle bones and if i flex them whoo look at that and i'm sitting down isn't that cool this is crazy um it's really weird even though I lost weight and I know I'm smaller than what I used to be I know this is gonna sound crazy I still don't have a good concept of what I actually look like people see me and they go oh my god you're so small and right now I'm looking at myself in this camera and I'm looking at you know where my shoulders are compared to my hair <laughs> and it's wild because I don't ever remember myself looking that way um, I lost a little over 85 pounds I decided to stop I did not stop my round I just tried to slow down the weight loss at the end of the last round um, sometimes I kind of have some regrets and wish maybe after about 15 pounds of the last round I would have stopped I think I ended up losing 30 it could have been a little bit too much I um, am working on trying to gain a few pounds back I know that sounds really crazy but it's because my boobies got way smaller y'all i went from a 44 double d to a 36 double i mean to a 36 d and i know people go with well, 36 d you know it's not flat chested and you still have a nice size rack but it ain't working for me and then i have like they're not saggy but i still got some skin that's around there that i don't like i'm not feeling it so and i know that you can't control where your weight goes when you gain it but i'm gonna gain a few pounds and see what happens and if i gain it guess what y'all 
I know all about the HCG, so it'll come right back off. <laughs> is that abuse? Is that abuse of HCG? I'm not sure, but um, I'm one of those people. I want my waist and my stomach as small as possible, and the bigger booty and boobies and thighs I can get, all the better. I'm trying to be thick with it. So, um, still been working out. Haven't been able to do P90X because my spine has been acting up. So, I'm doing Kempo X. Um, out of P90X, I was doing Ab Ripper X and my spine wasn't feeling that either. Um, I do scissors, um, alternating arms. Uh, what else do I do? Russian twist. I'm trying to think. There are like four or five ab exercises that I do now and they seem to be doing wonderful, you know, as far as my back. And at first I wasn't thinking that they really don't work because um, it's not as challenging as like when you do Ab Ripper X. But they are working um, i'm starting to see some tone and a little bit of definition in my midsection so um, i'm just going to keep at it and try and make it through the holiday season and hopefully in february i will be able to do a brand new progress video i know that other one is still floating around but i want to do like a new new one and i know i could do one even though i've lost some more weight but i want to wait until i'm like you know to my body looks more the way that i want it to look mostly my bit my biggest problem is still in my midsection as far as getting it toned um anyway i just wanted to give y'all an update um love everybody miss everybody i actually i'm gonna try and get out of here a little early today because i gotta hit the grocery store and go home and cook some dinner and do stuff like that that i haven't been doing in the past few weeks and so in my early them i'm gonna try and watch and catch up on a lot of vlogs because i'm really behind and i just kind of whenever i get a free minute i check in and that's about the most that i've been doing and i just really want to catch up and see what everyone else has been up to how the weight loss is going how they're maintaining um i know some of y'all are like down to size four like to fours now and eights and you know some of y'all have gone from like size 24s down to like 16s and it's just amazing keep hope alive don't get discouraged in the holiday season um i've gotten a few inboxes about people beating themselves up so much because you know maybe at thanksgiving you had a piece of cake or you ate some pie or you know you caved and had some dressing or if you stayed with your p2 food you ate too many of them y'all the holidays are about family and friends and enjoying each other's company and making memories and i mean everybody slips up from time to time it is not the end of the world just remember just because you slip up doesn't mean it's the end of you don't have one bad day and be like well i had one bad bad day so you know my diet is over and i should just go balls to the wall and eat everything have your one bad day say okay i did that moving on <laughs> have yourself a pop day some people will be pop and they'll drop the weight right off some of y'all may need to be pop and then do a correction day but whatever i'm just saying don't give up hang in there um think about how much weight you've lost so far how much smaller you look hope you're keeping track of your measurements um that's the best way because i'm telling y'all your eyes and your mind still did not see what you actually look like to the rest of the world and how much of yourself you're actually melting away or shaving away so um keep some good records so y'all can keep track of everything and just don't give up just because you have one bad day or a little incident doesn't mean that you're a bad person or that you're undeserving to lose weight or that something is wrong with you and all of this kind of stuff we're all great we're all wonderful we're all beautiful we're all here for a common goal to lose weight and just keep going if i can do it anybody can do it because lord knows i tried some of everything and the weight wasn't going anywhere anyway that's it that's enough this has gotten way too long for me just to be wanting to say hey uh oh y'all see my shoulders blinging ow 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 anyway see y'all later bye